As a tour pro, choosing a golf ball is really personal. How did you end up playing the Strixon ball? Yeah, I started out uh, in college when I was about to turn pro. At the time, I wanted, I wanted to try different companies' balls. I just wanted to see what worked, what could work the best for my game. Um, and the Strixon worked the best. I'm a huge factor for me in Texas. I went to Texas A&M. It's really windy here in Texas, um, and I did not grow up in wind, so I had to really adjust. Um, and as soon as I switched to the Strixon ball, it, um, it helped dramatically. The Strixon Z-Star XV. How do you judge whether a ball works for you? Chipping, it's a little softer, which I liked and I wanted to. It, again, it's just a little more feel, a little more spin with it, um, and even just simple pitch shots. You know whether you're able to flight it and you can put some real check on it and stop it when you want. Um, or again, you can hit your release shots or whatever shots you want. And then obviously off the driver, it's a little bit hotter as well, which is good. So it's it's done both, you know, it's done the feel wise, the spin wise with wedges, putting. But for me, it's really just the numbers. As long as my numbers are consistent with it and they're the numbers that I want to see, then that makes me more comfortable with it and be able to trust it. So I've won three times with it, got on, to the PJ Tour the last two years, and it's been working great. People at home think that we just throw a ball down and use anything, but it's got to match your game. It's got to exactly. match the speed of your driver and the control around the greens with your wedges. Thanks so much. No, thank you. I use the Tour Yellow. Yeah. The reason I use the Tour Yellow is when I hit it into the water, <laughs> I can quickly take my, my penalty and move on. <laughs>